Feature Friday. The freshest. Bitch. <laughs> Let's watch Anita uh, and J Balvin downtown. You guys recommended this to us. Oh my gosh, my shoulder. You guys recommended this oh my to gosh, us. You're such a granny. On um on the previous video we did, we watched two videos of Anita actually, which were great. She's good looking. I like could watch her all day. And he gave me big nostalgia moment. Yeah. He gave me really big homesickness. And we like, and I've, I've always said it, like, we love music. Um, and I'm not even from Brazil, but it gave me, like, the biggest nostalgia ever. Yeah, but the, the thing about Brazil is that I've, it's like uh, everyone's so warm, but they all they all have, like, this sort of swagger to them. <laughs> They're all gangsta. It, uh, I wouldn't <laughs> say gangsta. Yeah, but, yeah, you know, in that they sense that of, street, like... Yeah, yeah, they have, like, street cred. <laughs> No, they don't. But it's it's like how I do think you explain sense, it? I think that what you're trying urban. to say is it's like urban, real. Yeah, it's urban, urban realness. Yeah, I just I just feel like it's ripped jeans and jewels. From yeah, exactly. It's very it's very uh, 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 juxtapositioned the way they are. It's like luxury yeah. but with street, with urbanism, with mm. with uh, realness. Like there's no. It doesn't feel like there's much of a mask. And they're gorgeous humans. Yeah, I mean, Brazilian women are unbelievable. Brazilian men are like a sight to be seen. So we, we thought, as we were li liking the music from Anita, let us know if there's any other artists in Brazil, from or from Brazil, that, uh, that you'd like us totally to check, check out. out. Yeah, because I'm absolutely down for it. I like that rapper. Perhaps a male singer this time, then next time, you know, somebody shirtless, perhaps, I you wonder, know? I wonder what. <laughs> That's Bra in Samba, maybe. Yeah, I wonder if, if there's like any artists that people would be interested in watching like that do Samba or... or... Like at Brazilian funk is so popular, yeah. so good. I'm down, I'm down, let's do it. Okay, so this is Anita with J Balvin downtown. Yeah. We know J Balvin brings heat. We know Anita brings heat. Ooh. Casino Royale vibes. Oh, I really like this one. Reggaeton, eh? Yeah. <laughs> Jay, so funny, dude. He's so funny, isn't he? I told you they were speaking in Spanish. Well, now. I told you! What do you mean? I saw the lyrics! I haven't heard the song. I saw the lyrics. I told you they were speaking in Spanish. What? You never said that one? <laughs> I said it! No one disputed that with you. you I probably like, rim, 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 rim. I probably thought they were going to speak in Spanish anyways because J Balvin. Yeah, but you didn't think that you were going to speak Oh, you mean that we Spanish. should be speaking in Spanish? Yes. Why? Because they're speaking Spanish. Oh, I, how about this? In our next one, would you like <laughs> us to speak in Spanish or English? Whatever you guys say goes. Because uh, we don't mind. We but don't I'll, mind. For Rosalia, we do a lot of Spanish stuff. Mm -hmm. uh, but, yeah, I, I don't know. if, Yeah. It's okay. It's sort, of like, it's sort of like reggaeton. So maybe people that like reggaeton but don't speak Spanish are going to watch us. Maybe okay, like... fine. Let's just carry on. I'm just, I'm just saying. It's a good point. For, for argument's sake. It's a good point, yeah. I've I, pointed I what it out. Saying, yeah. It's pretty good. I like this. The beat is really cool. Look at her, like, come on. It's a vibe, dude. It is. A drink. The beach. Why is she so gorgeous? That's nice, dude. And she's... It's like... It's like reggaeton with kisomba. A bit, yeah. Yeah, it's a good shout. It's weird, like... It's a weird beat. I think that's one of those... Uh, in Kizomba, Kizomba is like really laid back, but it's like it has that, tukum, 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 but it's like slowed down. So you the know? one that you dance, uh, it's like the one, ones that I can dance. Two, three, one. So yeah, like that's that. the one that yeah, I can yeah, dance, yeah. yeah. The one that we couldn't figure out. Yeah, that one. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. We, try, we try to do this. Uh, Kizomba ago. classes. Yeah, and I had to dance with this lady. and uh, They were so good. <laughs> it was very weird. Because, you know. 
when you grow up in Latin America, you learn to dance as you grow up. But it doesn't mean you're actually a good dancer, like technically good. It just means you know how to dance basically every rhythm. Because basic. Yeah. And no, uh, you can, intermediate, you get up to intermediate, yeah, you don't, I mean, don't get too advanced. No come on, way. You, you go to all the parties, you gotta dance. Like exactly. you can't just be sitting there. But yeah. um, which is completely different now to to when we went to this traveled classes. the ocean to go to this part of Europe. It's uh, it, here is is a bit different. And people were like talking in numbers, you know, like literally gauging you by numbers one and two and three and five and six seven and one when before it's and we like, were like what do you mean ring, seven no, like, <laughs> literally <laughs> it's like what are you doing just feel the rhythm bit yeah yeah literally <laughs> but it, it, that was one of those rhythms that i just could not get a grasp on for some reason and it's because i think they explained it really weirdly to us we, we didn't understand that yeah it was one of those latinos that had been on europe for like twenty five thousand. and years. they they literally knew how to like teach by ballroom like ballroom style yeah and you'd be like yeah cool i think if i would have learned no it on idea. the street just with a few girls or whatever i probably would have been better yeah but, but yeah he took our money <laughs> but it, it, <laughs> <laughs> it was just like and you were dancing with this old guy for some reason oh yeah but I was really good because I'm a dancer so I, I understood what they were saying but even yeah, the concept I'm, of <laughs> I'm not a uh, I never studied dance I just learned to dance in parties and stuff like that yeah. and I'm I'm decent. I'm baila, good. baila. <laughs> Your Suliano <Yeah>. friends. <laughs> you know, every girl, every, you know, even like some guys, like they come up to you and they're like, oh, teach me how to do this. And you're like, yeah, just do that. You teach me with a girl and stuff like that. It's like, yeah. But not because you're actually like, you've done training or I've done, got, you know, I went to a university college. Who does that? I never. mean, so, your, your neighbors at five o'clock in the this afternoon. This type of music though is just a feel. It's a vibe. If you get girls dancing to this in a club, you don't even have to know to dance, mate. Just, just relax. Just feel it. And just, just let it do work and you work a little bit and just relax and just survive. Just feel it. And this is what I'm missing by being stuck at home. Yes. We can't feel it. <laughs> oh man, what? This gets me nostalgic. For just <laughs> of leaving the house. <laughs> you know what I mean? Of, of what well, I'm missing. life is like outside of these doors. Yeah, literally. <laughs> Keep going. She could be a Bond girl. She could be any girl. <laughs> oh my, my god. god. What are they like? Detectives. Yeah, I think they're trying to. The cover. Sabrosa, how's nice. Oh, Jesus. Ah, le están robando así, muleta. She's so cool. Why is she so cool? She's such a easy woman to look to. <laughs> and that's why I have trust issues. <laughs> Just right there. And that's the Trust reason. issues. <laughs> Trust issues. <laughs> Literally, bro. She's such a so such a distracting thing to look at. She's gorgeous. Like she's actually so yeah, she's so good looking. Like she's gorgeous. It's so weird. Oh, you so just weird. You should be, be focusing like on your her. cards or you or, just wanna be her, you know? Yeah. You know, th she's one of those women that you look at and you just think, dang it, I just wish I could be her. You know? <laughs> yeah. Like they she has the Kardashian effect. Mm. You know what? In it's me. Weird. It's weird because it's it's very um it's it has that vibe of obviously like she knows she's good looking. Mm -hmm. But, but it, she doesn't have a ship on arrogant. her shoulder. Yeah, yeah, it's not yeah, arrogant, yeah. Which is really attractive. Like she knows that she can get anyone's attention without having to be extra, you know? So cool. She's so laid back. Yeah, that's a good business. We should start business. No. Right? With Anita. No. <laughs> that's a terrible business. No, Efra. If cameras didn't exist. <laughs> Literally, they're yeah. the boleta robbing people. It's so funny, bro. It's so funny. Satisfaction. I mean, that's the one that I had on now. I feel 
she's so gorgeous. <laughs> so unlucky. Uh, I don't like your new balls. Your balcony is fire. Oh my gosh. <laughs> Tell you this, she reminds me of a girl I used to date. She's so gorgeous. But she's like 25 pounds <laughs> better. Damn, she's so beautiful. Can you imagine dating a woman like that? Maluma apparently had a little thing with her. No way. Yeah, that's why Con in that razón. video. That's they why in looked, that video. They look so cozy. Yeah, dude, song. as soon as you swap to Spanish, like a thousand percent Latina <laughs> energy comes this way. <laughs> <laughs> and you know what's the worst part that I try to hold it down? And nah, I'm man. like. You shouldn't control <laughs> control it you shouldn't try and control it i'm just playing your mouth okay thanks it's like a wave of water a <laughs> water water yeah uh yeah well you know yeah i, I think like they it. had a, i think they had a thing they definitely did i mean in a that people video were saying in the comments. well in that video they just seemed too cozy they were just too cozy this video seemed other. a bit more professional yes it did very but hard for jay barvin though i mean he has women jumping at him 24 7 he's probably bored He's probably fine. Yeah, but with his lifestyle. Yeah, but I need to special that. He's doing great. Yeah, but you know what? I saw this photo of Rosalia with J Balvin. They do. They make a really cool big, couple. Really? Yeah, they That's actually true. look cool together. It's because Rosalia has such a baby face, doesn't she? Rosalia's good looking. Yeah. Anyway, so this song was so cool. This is a calm down song. You know, it's one of those after the club. Tunes. Yeah, this is the after party vibe. Yeah, it is. When it stuff is. goes down. Oh, sure. oh, not again. All right. <laughs> uh, mate. All right. I think we're done with this one. <laughs> Nick. Sup, people. If you're a dancer. <laughs> Sup, people. If you're watching this and you're a rapper or a beat producer, a singer, a ghostwriter, or even just somebody who likes new music. And this is for you. Feature Friday is the show where we make new music every week featuring your tracks, your raps, your lyrics, or yourself as an artist. There's no catch. This isn't one of those weird posts where you click on the website and you're trying to order airports and they say it's free and then you have to pay like a hundred thousand million dollars for uh, shipping. Uh, this is completely free. We understand how difficult it is in the music industry to get seen and there's so many amazing rappers and singers and beat producers out there. So this is just a place to showcase your skills. We showcase our skills, we make music every week, which we love doing anyways. We get to show new artists to new people and new people to new artists. So if you'd like to get featured next, message me here on Instagram or email me and we will get in touch pretty soon. Please do it fast because uh, a waiting list is forming and we don't want anyone waiting around. Keep scrolling by. See you Friday. Peace. Bye-bye.